The Varsity Blues are back-to-back -back OUA champions, claiming their 10th OUA title in program history and claiming the lone OUA berth to the CIS National Championships, hosted in Brandon University next weekend. The team was awesome. You know, we talked about staying the course and, you know, getting the job done, trusting our systems, and they brought it today. It was, it was awesome. Like, played solid. I'm so proud of them. And it's so much fun to win on home court. I'm sorry, it's awesome. It feels fantastic. We worked so hard all year. Uh, I came back because I wanted a back-to-back -back championship, and that's exactly what I got. So I am floored. But we deserve it. We definitely worked hard. I'm really proud of the team. Tessa was just crushing it. I mean, it just looks like clean volleyball. Every time she went around for the step, you knew before she even hit it, it was going to be a kill. She looked really confident out there, and she really stepped up when we needed her. Uh, Tessa Davis had some amazing kills. She just kept going with that, running that step, and nobody could stop her. Also, Anna Fiora on the outside, like, she's short, but man, can she swing, and she has some really good, like, hits, so it was fantastic. Like, everybody, you know, brought something today, which is, which I think was the difference, that everybody was really strong today and solid, and we, we stayed on course, and we got the job done. Uh, going into nationals, we're going in to win. Um, I think sometimes people don't expect an OUA team to win, but we know that we've got it. Next up is nationals. Um, OUA was fantastic, but uh, I want a nice shiny gold medal, national medal. Um, so the next step is just we have to prepare, like we still have to keep working, and I want the gold. That's I'm not going to be happy unless we get it, so the next step is the quarterfinal on Thursday.